use. So would you remove M.2 stickers before installing under heat sinks? Um, and Asus Hero 12 motherboard. Oh, okay. Um, so a lot of M.2 stickers are foil that are designed to be constructed in a sharpened screw. I'm uh, magnetizing it so it stops dropping the screw. They're designed to be a heat spreader. So you sh I actually, I pitched that question to Alan Alvin Town on Twitter not long ago on behalf of the viewer. Uh, you should um, generally leave it on there, uh, but for some of these heat sinks, you ideally want to cut the thermal pads where there's contact with the NAND flash, because it will live longer with uh, under higher active temperatures, and then you should um, keep the thermal pads where there's contact with the uh, um, controller. And that's how I would do it. As for the sticker, I don't remember. I, I'd probably just do the same thing. If you're already cutting thermal pads, I think I'd just remove the sticker and just contact it directly with the controller and not with the NAND. No, it's, it's not going to hurt anything to take it off. Right, yeah. You can always take it off in a way that preserves it, too, in case you need to RMA it later or something. Um, 